in this video i'll be showing you um, what accessories you need to build a diy path also is it recommended to do diy in this age or you should just buy one of those um pre-made pack and be good if you want to have fun and diy your batteries let's see what are the accessories you need to build a pack aside the cells and the bms the first thing you need is basically the cell okay so this is one of the cell okay so all the batteries you see out there are made up of cells individual cells like pro 4 battery and the nominal voltage is 3.2 and you have the nominal capacity is 150 amps and you have the nominal energy as 480 watt hours so we have eight of this okay so we have eight of this to make a 24 volt pack we've made the calculation easier for us if you want to know the capacity of the total battery you know you just multiply 480 480 times 8 is 3840 watt hour or 3.8 kilowatt hours okay. 25.6 volts that's the nominal voltage and the capacity will remain the same because we are connecting all these batteries in series so the first thing you will notice here is that how flat these batteries are so you can see how flat they are okay so there's no space in between so if you check here you can see there's no space at all so there's no space so that's um one of the feature or one of the appearance tests we we do when we are checking for grade a cells the next thing you need is the bms okay so this is the bms this bms has a one amp active balancer in it and you can see it can do 200 amps continuous and peak power of 350 and you have four to eight strings so we are using the the whole eight string so this is the balance lead used for connecting the voltage sense okay then this is a switch so this one has a switch and this switch always blow this is temperature sensor to me measure the temperature of the batteries and these are the screws that comes with it to screw the terminals okay so this termin these terminals here we use this screw on it so the next thing here is this ring terminal so the ring terminal is used to lock in this uh, balance lead in place then this bms this is the screen so this screen also has as a switch so you can either use that switch or we add this screen to the battery moving forward we have the cable okay so i'll be using this 16 mm cable i'll be using double of this in this project this is a screwdriver of course you need that this is log this is log we are going to be using and here we also have this thing called the each each shrinks so this is the each shrinks here and we also have we also have the breakers okay and these guys bus bands we use to interlock these uh, batteries okay so we are using it to connect from one battery to the other then we have this flange nuts so you have this nut to screw in those terminals okay so we are using this one as well cable tie to clean up the cables so at the exterior of the battery we are using these terminals okay so this is a 200 amps terminal and this is a 120 amps terminal you can see the difference i'll be using this 200 and this is to close the terminal this bms has an app so you can see this is the jk bms app so you also need a phone to do the configuration either android or iphone so this is it gone this is hydraulic crimper this is also crimper for ring terminals so this is spanner this is a cutter this is cable stripper you need knife also cable cutter for those big cable once we build this pack as a battery we need it we need to put it in an enclosure okay so the enclosure i will be using is this hdf um casing how much will it cost to build this 24 volt 3.8 kilowatt batteries okay so here we have the cost of the cell okay so this is the cost of the cell 600,000 75,000 each times 8 then this comes with the battery so you don't need to buy this comes with the battery as well you don't need to buy so you need a bms so that bms you're seeing there will cost you 
120,000. Okay, so this breaker will cost you about 10,000. So the terminal you're seeing over here, this terminal will cost you 15,000. Okay, so this each string, I got it in bulk, so let's just add 2,000 for that. So, cable tie, you won't use much. Let's add 500. This cable you are seeing here, that's 16 mm. So, per meter is 3,000. So, we'll use 2 meter, let's say 6,000. Okay, 6,000. It will cost you about 800,000 to make these batteries. All right. Thank you.